In step six of exercise number five, the following actions have to be implemented to machine the counter bores and vent slots with iMachining 2D. For the purpose of this exercise, you have to define a new tool to perform the next sequence of iMachining 2D operations. In the Solid Cam Manager, double click the tool header to display the Part Tool Table dialog box. Click the Add Milling Tool button to start the tool definition. Select End Mill from the Milling Tools list. Under the Topology tab, set the diameter value to 1.5 mm. Set the remaining tool parameters as follows. Total length, 50 mm. Outside holder length, 22 mm. Shoulder length, 10 mm. And cutting length, 6 mm. Change the number of flutes to 3. Then switch to the iData tab and change the helical angle parameter to 35 degrees for this particular tool. When I machining with small tools, it is recommended to select a machining level that is two or three levels below the usual. For this particular tool, set the default level to three. Even in a micro machining environment, when using very small tools, the most important requirement is typically the accuracy and surface finish, not speed or cycle time. For very small tools, the wizard generates small engagement angles and very small chip thickness, so the cutting conditions are suitable. Click the OK button to save the tool definition and exit the part tool table. 